This is tutorial number 133, and it covers anchor points within Katia v5. To start off, open up tutorial part number 127, which is located on the DVD. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to go over anchor points, and what these do is that when we're using uh, and trying to dimension circular objects or curves, we're able to uh, select certain anchor points and those are the anchor points that we're going to be positioning and creating our dimensions from. So say I want a dimension from this line here to this edge here. I want to know the dimension uh, vertically, how far it is away from each other. Normally I'd go and click the length, click the vertical, click this line, click this line here, but what I'm getting is the center point of that curve. That's not what I want. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to play around with the uh, anchor points. Now to get to the anchor points, it's while you're positioning it. So let's click length. We'll click this line here. Click this line here. Right click. And the line anchors. There's the first ones and the second ones. Now the first one is going to uh, be your first point that you selected. So there's anchor one and anchor two. Right now it's on anchor two. If I put it to anchor one, it's going to be up there. So let's position it on anchor two. I'm happy with that there. Now let's go and we'll change the anchor for the circle. So the second extension line, let's put it to one. That's not what I want. Put it to three, and that's what I want. So you're just going to have to play around with the anchor points until you get it. And once you get it, click OK, and you've positioned it. So you can do this with uh, lines, circles, uh, whatever it may be. If you're two objects, if you're having trouble uh, getting the actual dimension you want, you might need to play around with the anchor points. Now, you're also able to use uh, the intersection point detection. That's going to help you get uh, your some anchor points. Like I can get this point here, but I can't find the anchor point here using the, the uh, intersection point detection. So you can anchor it down with this and then click down here and then play around with the extension line. So I'll put it to three, put it to one. Every time it's going to be different. Depends what you're using and what you're dimensioning. So using the anchor points, again, it's going to keep your uh, drawings more precise, more accurate, easier to read, and it's going to get you the results that you want. And that concludes our tutorial on anchor points within Katia V5.